let's read this word of god isaiah 41 verse 10 let's read this word of god do not fear do, do not, not fear for i am with you for i am with you do not be afraid do not be afraid for i am your god for i am your god i will strengthen you i will strengthen you i will help you i will help you i will uphold you i will uphold you with my victorious right hand with my victorious right hand my brothers and sisters there is a background for this bible passage this is when israelites were in sinful bondages they lost the protection of god presence of god as a result the babylonians came and attacked them and took them into exile they were completely broken they were taken to another country babylon and they were in exile and there they repented and cried they were they felt their god has abandoned them they were so worried and that is when god gave them this message two things one is do not be a do not fear is a command a command and second is a promise always when god gives a command there is a promise attached to it when god command you something then there is a promise attached to it therefore god told them do not fear i am with you so this is something the lord wants to tell us everyone who fall into sin and make mistake and go through the consequences and at the end we feel god has abandoned us we have abandoned god and god has abandoned us now we are in consequences of the sins and we feel so helpless and lowly but god wants to give you all a message in when in that situation that is do not fear i am with you praise the lord praise the lord so just because you committed sin and gone away from the presence of god doesn't mean god will abandon you maybe you may go through the consequence of your sin you may go through some kind of slavery of the evil but god says don't be afraid i am your father i will not leave you i am with you do not be afraid i am your god because they went to babylon and suddenly they thought the god of israel is failed and god of babylon is more powerful because see the god of babylon has made them victorious and god of israel made us failed so this made them so disturbed and therefore god says i am your god i will strengthen you i will help you i will uphold you with my victorious right hand i will bring you back and it really happened god brought them back from babylon within no time in their own lifetime so this is the promise god wants to give all of us who are in struggle difficulties situations you are going through the lord says of course we all make mistake and we make we fall into sin we have may have abandoned our god for a time being but if we are ready to repent and come back if we are ready to repent and go for confession if we are ready to turn back to the lord and come back to the lord god says do not fear i am with you do not be afraid i am your god i will strengthen you i will help you i will uphold you with my victorious right hand 